In this 100-bit review, I'm going to walk you through this software itself. I'm going to show you everything you need to know step by step. So what is actually Heartbeat? Heartbeat is actually a communication and sharing platform that let you host chat, live event, content and course under your own domain. So they can actually create group membership structure with dedicated channel and forum. Also host your, your community interaction in one place from chat track to live event. So who's actually suitable to use Heartbeat itself? Heartbeat is actually suitable for a startup educator who want to build a streamlined community hub. So without wasting much time, let me show you the Heartbeat software itself. So for the very first thing you need to do is actually create your account. And then right after that, you need to name your community name. So let me name my community name first. Okay, then right, you, you can put in your community name and then you will auto populate this community name URL. So you can actually have options to upload a logo and choose your color. So for this demo, I will choose this default color as red. All right. So right now, they're actually creating your community. Okay. So uh, right after that, you can actually upload a profile picture, which I'm going to do it. Okay. And then you can actually, for this purpose, I'll just upload a random okay, picture. Then you can, uh, once you upload a picture, press next. Okay, put in your name. Okay, tell us something about yourself. Okay, just put hi. Hi. Just for this demo, I'll just put a short one. Okay. So once it's done, just put finish. Okay. So just need to wait then. Right now, they will actually show you a video. Okay. You can actually go through a video. It's a very short video. Okay. So once you watch your short video, the next thing you will show you is the platform itself so you can actually see on the left there's actually some navigation which i'm going to show you later on so on the first on the center you can actually see the uh, kickstart itself all right so you can actually you can kickstart importing existing community connecting your tools which is actually connect connect notions or connect zoom okay you can actually create a channel here create a document create event set community team customize onboarding and invite members as well okay so right now what i'm going to show you is actually navigation you can actually uh, uh, start a thread here you can actually do a thread here this is actually your thread your documents okay you can actually add in your documents events directory you can do a matchup okay well, i'm going to explain further what is actually matchup and your analytics okay which are going to tr go through everything okay so by doing your creating your channel okay just press here or you can actually uh, press into thread. So this is actually the channel which was actually a default one. Okay. So in any case, I'm going to go through everything. Okay. So for general announcement, no stupid questions or introduction, which I actually did earlier on. So for general, you can just start a thread. Okay. But just say hi. And you can actually add a poll here. Option one, option two, actually add in all your uh, options here. If you want more, just add here. If you want to put anonymous post, just toggle it off and on. Right after that, you can you can actually delete this or you can actually add in a file and just post it. Okay. For a user, once they actually see a post, they can also okay. They can also add in a file here. They can actually add in a reply. Or add in a GIF. Okay. So you can add in any GIF here. So this is actually how a user can interact. Okay, so you can also re you can actually react by sending a emoji here. Okay, let me just let me just send in an emoji here, or you can add in more emoji. Okay, or you can actually delete this, or you can actually put a permanent link. Okay, so this is actually how you can actually interact with the track itself. All right, or the post. Sorry. Okay. So for announcement, you can actually add something as well. Okay, it's the same as the general yeah, itself. Okay, just put hi. You can actually post. So people can start to interact with your post. Okay, so in any case, you can actually add a permanent link, mute, move, save, or you can actually pin it, expand, or delete it. Okay, or you can actually add it. Okay, so this is actually the track itself which you can actually create at your end. Okay, so you can actually see 
everything is also essentially here and if you uh, realize there's actually a three button here you can actually edit it okay so for your if let's say you want to change your name to a general you can actually you can actually change to any of the name you should want a description is actually optional you can actually set this as a default channel or set this as a read only okay so right now you can just just press submit okay so for here you can also do the uh, editing you can actually change anything here you can change the name at your end okay so it's the same okay so one thing is cool about this is you can actually create a voice room okay actually water cooler is actually a voice room all you need to do is just click and join okay and then you can actually either cancel it or yes don't ask again so you can actually join okay now you're actually connecting to everybody in here okay in the water cooler okay right then you can actually mute your mic you can actually start video you can just start sharing your screen or you can actually invite members there's also audio settings or you can actually leave the call okay so this is actually how you conduct some live training or live chat or whatever you want okay using this water cooler or voice room okay so once you once if let's say you want to leave the call just press leave the call okay so this is how so let me create a voice room at my end so let's name a voice room give a name voice creating okay so actually connecting to a call right now so it's actually the same thing okay it's actually the same thing as the water cooler but this is my own room okay so from there you can actually leave the call okay so for this uh, voice room as well you can actually edit okay you can actually uh, change your name put a description set a private channel you can actually set the attendee limit you actually write to five or set a set as a private channel you can actually search for member or you can or groups itself okay so after that you can actually toggle all and then submit okay so basically track this is actually how the track actually works okay so I actually I'll show you how people can interact all these things all right so the next one is actually documents okay you actually uh, put in your documents for example this is actually a default uh, documents input by heartbeat if you want to input more files okay upload more files here okay and if anybody can actually interact with the documents itself okay so and the next one is actually event you can actually create your event okay you can just set the agenda monthly agenda or agenda itself you can actually create your event you can actually toggle off my past event and upcoming event Okay, so I can actually create an event here. So I can put in your name, uh, name of event. Maybe just put my name. Okay, and your description. You can set the date and time. Like that. Right now it's actually one hour. Okay, or you can actually connect to an external calendar. Okay, where the event will be held. Heartbeat, custom, or Zoom itself. Okay, you can actually up, uh, whether is it a unique uh, voice channel or what using water cooler. Okay. Let me just choose unique then just press next okay you can actually invite your members here or you can actually request feedback request RSVP okay public whether you can toggle it off and on whether is it public event whether do you need a ticket to be, uh, attend as well okay so and then you can actually set a reminder you can actually add more reminder or send an email reminder as well okay so right now then after that you can just create events okay but for this demo i'm not going to create the events and then I just cancel okay so for directory okay you can actually search for your member here right now there's actually three profile myself and the members for heartbeat which is the administrator or this is at the founder as well okay so for matchup okay matchup is actually very interesting okay let's say your community have a certain interest maybe like a uh, uh, sports interest you can actually create a matchup then you can actually add in user okay right now there's only me and the founder so you can actually press next you can actually create okay you can actually create a group size you can create match up with two or three percent if you select group of three you can create as many groups as of three as you can the remaining user will put into the groups of two okay so this is actually a matchmaking pool a matchmaking pool is the group of community member within within which we match people combine different heartbeat groups to commit to create a customized matchmaking matchmaking pool 
and we take care of connect, connecting all, all the people within the pool automatically. So this is a matchmaking pool, which is actually very interesting. Okay, so you just create your own pool here. You can also allow subgroup matching. Okay, generally we don't match member within the same subgroup to prevent people from being matched with too close associate to them. Turning this on removes this filter so that anybody in the group can be matched with each other. Okay, so this is actually like a match matchmaking set, matchmaking, and then this is actually the setting itself. Okay, right after that you can actually press next. You can actually review the message and confirm and send. Okay, so this is actually the matchmaking auctions okay this is actually very interesting created by heartbeat itself so right now just cancel this okay and then i will just opt out from this match up so this matchup is actually very interesting okay you you can actually set a community match up right now if let's say you have certain interest which you want to match them up to create some uh, interaction okay so moving next is actually the analytics okay you can just see your overview analytics okay you can see the activity Okay, hold on, then you can see the activity, you can see how many public conversation, how many DMs, top active user, top track, top channel. Okay, everything is being set up properly. So your engagement. Okay, you can actually see your engagement as well. So you can see uh, via your chart, the track engagement, number of message, number of login, number of document view, number of voice room. Okay, so basically, this is how the heartbeat works. So what? The next thing I'm going to show you is the navigate is actually the admin setting. Okay, for admin setting, you can actually put whether is it custom domain, whether is there any weekly digest, email notification. You can actually hide user email, disable profile editing. There's also some uh, integration for Google Calendar, Outlook, Zoom, Salesforce, Notion, Zapier, Circus, and Slack. Also, says community team. You can actually upload your community logo. You can change your color and background color. So there's also an up onboarding setup. Okay, you can actually select all these questions for this new member. Okay, you can actually choose all these questions. You, know, you can add questions and you can actually delete it. Where okay, you can actually choose whether is it require and then include answer user bio or you can actually private again. Okay, so you can actually set a preview. You can actually see the preview here. Let me show you the preview. How is it like? Okay, so. This is, a, this is the preview which we did earlier on, okay? This is a preview of what your member will see which we did earlier on, okay? So this is like the onboarding as well, okay? So you can actually have this community apps as well. You can actually toggle on or off, okay? And community apps, then right now is the monetization, okay? You can actually connect your Stripe account to start collecting payment. Remember, there's actually uh, this live room where you actually create this uh, tickets itself. So you can actually connect to Stripes and then some API key, okay? So basically, this is actually a uh, heartbeat, okay? It's actually a very good platform to create some community here, all right? So if you, let's say, you are interested in heartbeat, Okay, right now this is actually an app sumo deal. Let me show you the deal itself. Right now the deal is actually at $69 for tier 1 where you can actually have 2,000 uh, members and unlimited storage. So for tier 2, it's actually unlimited members and unlimited storage. Okay, then you actually have the full heartbeat API key. Okay, so uh, the tier 1 is $69 for tier 2 is $159. If let's say you are actually uh, building your community, I would strongly suggest you actually get tier 2 because you have unlimited members, okay? And then, this is actually a alternative product called Slack itself, okay? Slack is actually have this uh, monthly uh, charges. Now, let's say you are uh, uh, just start up, want to build a community, I would strongly suggest you actually go for Heartbeat because this is actually a one-time charge of uh, 159 and it's actually a lifetime deal okay for slack it's actually a monthly deal and you will incur more you actually incur more cost itself okay so let's say you want to uh, buy this uh, heartbeat itself i have actually a uh, uh, link in the description box go ahead and click my link okay in the description box itself so i will actually earn a commission itself it's actually an affiliate link but it will not affect your purchase of 59 and 69 okay is actually to support this brand new channel itself okay so i hope you actually uh, learned something from me from this review and if let's say you have any question go ahead and comment down below for any question and if let's say you love to see such software review go ahead and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell okay 
So to the next review, I will see you. Remember to do the purchase using my link. I will see you. Take care. Goodbye.